And just when I saw what Manchester United's transfer window was done, I was wrong. So, Manchester United have signed Marcel Sabitzer from Bayern Munich. I know Sabitzer from being in Leipzig. He was a talented player there. Very good for that Leipzig team. Then he moved to Bayern. I haven't heard so much of him at Bayern. I know that he didn't get much opportunity at Bayern. That's a good move for Manchester United because recently Christian Eriksen got injured and therefore he's going to be out for maybe the rest of the season. So Sabitzer fits perfectly in the midfield next to Casemiro and Bruno. And I think he fits perfectly. It's not a permanent deal but it's a loan deal. And this also leads me to a video I wanted to make a long time ago but since this new signing it's a perfect time to make it. Manchester United and the Eric Ten Hag has been insane. They grows from Ragnik and Ole to this now. It's insane. Also competing for the title, you can say. Competing for four titles this season. It's crazy. They got rid of some players. Didn't do as Ragnik said, sell all the players, but Eric Ten Hag changed the mentalities of the players. That's why you see players like Luke Shaw, Rashford, Martial, Delo, Wambisaka even. A whole bunch of the players. So the signings they brought in. Malaysia was the first signing. Eriksen, Casemiro, Vegost, Butlin. They brought in the Brevka but he's now back by Newcastle. And now Sabitzer. Including, how can you ever forget, the Sandra Martinez. Those players were all, each and every one of them, changed the team, I would say completely. They let go of Christian Ronaldo after the interview. They sacked him from the squad. And then they bought Vegas. Vegas has been decent. And Marcel is also back now. Sancho is also back now. Sancho got a good ovation from the Man United fans, including Eric Ten Hag. He's doing what similar thing to what Klopp did, Pep Guardiola did, where they sign new players but also improve the players that were in the team. One player in particular used to play for Real Madrid, Casemiro. It's been insane, which he has always been. He's always been insane, but now he's getting more media attention, which is good for him. I think Manchester United will still have to get rid of a few more players. Harry Maguire, obviously. That's what most fans ask. I think Maguire deserves a second chance, but that's just me. Uh, the Inter Milan also won Maguire, so I think Maguire should take that opportunity. There's also rumours about the, the owners of Manchester United that they will be selling the club in the future. I think that would be good for Manchester United. They'll have more money. To spend similar to Chelsea and Newcastle. They won't spend as recklessly as Chelsea, obviously. But that's it's a good sign for the future for Manchester United. And I won't be surprised if you see them back on the big stage in the UCL. So the future is looking bright for Manchester United. And Sabitzer, who is there but he's not on a permanent deal. He's on a loan just for the short season. He's going to go back to buy, but this is still a good sign for the club. But if you enjoyed the video, smash like and subscribe.